media personality Somizi Mshongom Tawung and his husband Mohale Mshongom Tawung seem to never be able to catch a break from trolls who are always meddling in their marriage. Heck, them trolls were even busy on New Year's Eve, man. Now, Somizi's relationship with his husband Mohale as well as his friend Vusinova was placed under scrutiny by many users on social media. But as we have come to expect from Somizi, he did clap back and put a lot of those trolls in their place. Now, before we get into the video, please do me a huge favor. If you are enjoying the content here on Red Live, do give this video a huge thumbs up. It does help out a lot. And also, if you are new to the channel and haven't subscribed, do hit that red subscribe button, hit the bell notification to be notified of future uploads. With that said, hello and welcome to Red Live. Now, the rumor speculations of a live triangle between Somizi, Mohalia, and Vusinova have been doing the rounds for quite some time, and they have quickly escalated following reports that Mohale and Somizi are allegedly headed towards a divorce. Now, the couple has allegedly separated with Somizi, according to the reports anyway, moving out of their marital home. Now, Mohale is also rumored to be spending less time at home and living his best life in the north. Now, adding fuel to this particular fire, Mohale attended his friend's funeral alone while his husband was parting up a storm in the presence of his true endless love, Vusinova. Now, the true endless love is Somizi's words. Now, allegations of infidelity have also played a major role on the ongoing social media bullying that they are suffering. It all started when they were still engaged with reports stating that Mohale had allegedly been cheating with some other guy. Heck, there were even reports that Mohale was cheating on Somizi with another woman. But fast forwarding to now, people are more focused on the fact that Vusi and Somizi are pretty much inseparable. Heck, Vusi Nova was even at Somizi's birthday party, he bought him some balloons, which Somizi seemed to be very fond of, might I add. Well, now it also seems that Vusinova and Somizi did spend New Year's Eve together. With Muhale nowhere in sight, and this of course has fueled the rumors even more. Now, according to the report, Somizi and Muhale spent their Christmases separate. Uh, they went to their families, and for New Year's Eve, Muhale was reportedly at his grandmother's house. Now, of course, New Year's Eve is a very special time for couples, more so, I would imagine, for married couples. I mean, if I was married, I'd be in them sheets deep in my partner from the 31st until the 1st. And when we get into 2021, I'd be like, you know what? I've been hitting this since last year. Because that's what you're supposed to be doing to your woman on new year's eve i suppose you could also be doing it to your guy i mean we don't discriminate here on red live in the case of somizi and muhale but like i said it does seem that muhale was at his grandmother's house and somizi posted a video of him and vusinova singing along to black diamond's hit song sama yomuti oh vusinova's got some painted fingernails huh but anyways as you can see in that video muhale is nowhere in sight now, like I said, this particular video was posted by Somizi. Now, he has removed the comments, but before he did that, there were definitely some nasty comments in the comment section. Now, Somizi did clap back and ask the trolls, why are they so invested in his personal life? Somizi replied and wrote the following, I have an ask to the people who are so invested in my love life. Is your festive that bad that you are so interested in what's happening between me, Vusi, and Muhale? Hi, it must be bad, shame, a uh, skis. How can I help but tongue at Muhale underscore Mutawung babe Caesar to at Vusinova love help. Look, I can only talk for me personally and I'm not all that invested in his life life with Somizi and his buddy best friend Vusinova. But I will answer the question, was your festive that bad? And yes, it was that bad. And also on a side note, I think when it comes to celebrity relationships, we should all teach ourselves to drink water. Mind our own business. Because at the end of the day, they could just come out and say that they were never even married. I mean, it's not like we were at the wedding itself. We didn't see them sign anything. And even if we saw some videos on social media, these could have been clips from a movie that they were shooting. A movie that went straight to cassette and no one watched. But yeah, do comment down. Down below and let me know what you guys thought about Muhale getting trolled after Somizi spends New Year's Eve with Vusinova. And as always, thanks for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to Red Live if you haven't and binge watch my previous videos.